It's incredible how places of great industry can be transformed, as if they'd never been there. And that is the case with this innocent looking field. Once there stood a great chemical works here that at first created sulfuric acid before moving on to washing soda. Yeesh, that's nasty stuff. The works were demolished by 1909 and not much is left except rubble, the industrial pollution and an interesting canal structure. Hidden in the undergrowth here is a dry dock and is the only known surviving one on the canal. This dry dock sits on a long infill branch of the canal that passed under this bridge at the bottom of the locks and was used to service and maintain the boats used by the works. When the undergrowth dies down it's easy to see how it once worked. Boats would enter it through the gates that would have been here and have been floated above the large stones that sit on the bed of the dock. The water would then be drained into the river Kroll until the boats sat on the stones which gave the workers access to the undersides. Once done, the dock would then be flooded and the boats floated away. Sadly, this unique structure is in poor condition and the private arm that led to it has been lost and infilled for years with a large concrete slab sat over the entrance. But it does show that even long lost industries still leave their mark on the landscape even over a century after they have gone. Uh -huh.